Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to WB2K17 My Career Mode. We are kicking the show off with Samoa Joe in action here tonight as John Carter looks to earn his way up the rankings here in NXT. There he is, the NXT champion right now. His name is Samoa Joe. And look out from behind. There's John Carter in a steel chair in hand, striking Samoa Joe once in the back and one in the forehead. Now he has the championship in hand. Carter strikes Joe right in the, in the head with his own championship. Carter wants the title and he sure as hell showing Samoa Joe that he is ready to fight for it. Joe though, back to his feet thanks to Carter, but Carter's, Carter though, tried to hit him with the pop pedal suplex, but it's not gonna happen because Samoa Joe now fighting back with a knee to the head. Joe trying to fend off Carter though, but Carter is able to sweep Joe off his feet and shut that down immediately. Carter's going for it again, but Joe with another counter. Samoa Joe with some huge counters here, keeping him in this contest. This back, back and forth exchange between the two and a backbreaker as well. Well, Carter thought he was going to get the jump from behind and beat up Joe comfortably. Well, Samoa Joe, the champion, making John Carter regret ever getting in his way. Joe with a senton, and that's it. Samoa Joe sends a massive statement here on main event, and now... We'll get ready for our matchup here tonight. It is going to be John Carter versus Shinsuke Nakamura as Carter looks to get the win he needs. Not exactly the start of the night that he would have liked, but he can bounce back here and get a win over Nakamura for his efforts. John Carter at the moment currently ranks in at number three in the NXT rankings. He's jumped up one since we last showcased Carter, and now he has a big chance to keep on moving up the ranks and perhaps, just perhaps, get himself a championship opportunity. But he needs to get a couple more big wins to prove himself that he's worthy and ready. Didn't exactly do that against Samoa Joe earlier on in the night. But hey, if he can step it up, if he can turn things around, he may be able to get this win over Nakamura here tonight. And maybe just get himself in contention in the future for the NXT Championship and get him the hell out of NXT. So here's his opponent, Shinsuke Nakamura, who was champion when John Carter was coming after Nakamura, but now it is Samoa Joe, so Carter's obviously switched gears to Samoa Joe rather than rather than Nakamura. So it's a bit of a strange move by Carter to come after whoever's champion, I guess, just and drop it immediately, not worry about Nakamura from then on, even though he kind of painted a bit of a target on his back, and now Nakamura's coming after John Carter here tonight to try and get himself actually back in title contention, trying to keep his number one contendership spot locked down here against Cutter tonight. So we're ready to go here. Cutter versus Nakamura underway right now as Cutter with a big start for the match with a clothesline. Nearly taking the head of Nakamura off. Well, that's what you want to do when you start a match off. Start off with a big strike to really set the tone and the pace of the match. And kind of send a bit of a message to your opponent right from the get-go and put some pressure on. That's a good start here for Cutter as he's stomping away on Nakamura now. You can see John Carter not exactly feeling 100% coming into this matchup. Not exactly um, moving around with all that much freedom. He's a little slowish, a little sluggish, but he should be okay to compete here tonight. Hopefully, if he can get the victory, he comes away unscathed because you would not want to risk an injury right now if you're John Carter. Getting closer and closer to the NXT Championship he is. Up and up the rankings at the moment. He just needs a few more big wins as turns it into a DDT, striking Nakamura head first. Rolls up with an elbow, didn't quite get all of it, but he's got enough of it to keep Nakamura down. Well, yeah, John Carter actually moving up the rankings, getting so, so close to getting himself a championship opportunity. An injury would be disastrous right now, and a loss would also be disastrous as well. He needs to win this match. If he keeps on winning, then he may just be the next man in line to take on the NXT champion Samoa Joe. Maybe he won't be. We'll have to wait and see, but he is getting closer and closer to that opportunity. He just needs to seal the deal with a couple more wins. And he'll have that spot locked up. Big power bomb there to Shinsuke Nakamura. Who hasn't started this match well at all. It's been all Cutter at the moment. And this is the type of message Cutter is looking to send here. Type of statement he's trying to make to everybody in the back. Especially our champion Joe. Nakamura now against the ropes. Here comes Nakamura. Both fists 
clenched together and strikes down on Kata. Follows up with a knee drop as well. Looking good right now is Nakamura. It's been pretty hard for him to move up the rankings. He's been trying to crack the top three for a long time. Has Kata. Just can't seem to move up as quickly as he would have liked. Despite getting a lot of wins, he's had a few losses along the way. That's kind of set him back a little bit. But now in the top three, now looking to put Nakamura away with the pop handle. Launches him to the other side of the ring, slamming him down. And now Kata. Lining up Nakamura. Going to introduce the Kata. Well, there it is. He's got the name Kata. And finally bringing out the move. Known as the Kata. But he doesn't get the win. That was as close as it gets to a three count. Even the referee, I think, slapped the three. But he said no. He kicked out just in the nick of time. So Kata brings out the Kata. But not good enough. So John has to continue to work away on Nakamura right now. You know, if you guys got any suggestions of what we should call the cutter, I know obviously it's the RKO, but should we, you know, switch it up, try something different, try a different name? If you've got any suggestions for what we can call the cutter, let me in the comments, let me know in the comments down below. And if uh, we find a good name, if you like a name, give it a thumbs up so I can see. And if we like a name, we'll um, think about using it. Elbow drop there by Cutter on the Nakamura who rolls out of harm's way. And look at Cutter now with these big shots, kicks and uppercuts and right hands. Now looking for another Cutter and he connects. Nakamura surely now is out of it. Going for the three. Nakamura is out and it's over. He can't, can't get back to his feet. He can't kick out. Knocked out Cole with a Cutter and that's it. So John gets a big win in tonight over Nakamura. Didn't exactly get the... Uh, the one up on Samoa Joe early on, but hey, a victory over Nakamura, arguably just as good. So, a good effort here by Carter. He's bringing out a few different moves as well to try and spice things up and improve his game. And that will certainly help him out when he does get to the NXT Champion Samoa Joe, whenever that is. Whenever he does get his hands on that championship. How long will it take? We'll find out. But it's a good match there by Carter. And now John Carter, back in the ring here, looking to Talk a few words about Samoa Joe here tonight and uh, get a few things off of his chest towards Samoa Joe. A lot of people are worried about what I'm going to do. And for good reason. I'm not a company man. I'm not a people person. I'm not anything but what I am, which is the reason I make money. I'm a concern to this company and a danger to every single superstar on this roster, especially one in particular. Oh. Well, I think he's talking about Samoa Joe, obviously. Lately, there's been a superstar walking around claiming to be everything that I am. And that doesn't sit well with me. You see, only one person can be the best. And despite his claims, it's clear that I'm the one who deserves everybody's praise. Not him. Well, Carter's pretty confident in himself right now. Believes he's the man, he's the one, not Samoa Joe. I don't know about that. He needs to kind of get that championship around his waist before we can boast a little bit here. Samoa Joe, let's see what you're made of. If it's anything other than hot air. Well, we'll see if Samoa Joe is going to come out and accept the challenge. I don't know about hot air, but Joe will take the challenge here. He looks pretty pissed off. I mean, obviously, why wouldn't he be getting jumped from behind by John Carter? John Carter now will await Joe's arrival into the ring. And these two men will go back and forth here. Samoa Joe looks pissed off. And looking to perhaps send a bit of a statement here to John Carter right now. We'll see. But uh, Samoa Joe, the NXT champion, enters the ring here. What will he have to say to John Carter here on main event? I'm going to keep this short and sweet. You and I have some problems we need to hash out. And I'm not going to wait any longer. The WWE Universe may not like me, but I could care less. When I'm out here, this is my time, and I won't let these people waste it. Well, Cutter, he's got Joe right in front of him. What will he finally say face to face with Joe? Hold on a second, you think you're gonna make this statement by interrupting me? Hold on a second, you think you're making a statement by interrupting me? I'm the greatest superstar to ever grace the inside of this ring, and the WWE Universe paid good money to hear me speak. So what do you have to say, hurry up, and be on your way. Well, Carter, he wanted Joe to come out here, but obviously he doesn't really want Joe to say too much. He just wants to speak to Joe himself. Look, nobody's listening to you anyway. As soon as they hear your music play, they hit mute. I just hope 
They caught me out of the corner of the eye and, and knew there was a reason to start paying attention again. Well, Carter doesn't look exactly look that impressed by that comment there by Samoa Joe. Basically saying that Carter perhaps is a little boring. Go on, keep them coming. Really? Give me everything you've got. Make the losers out in the nosebleeds laugh because when I get my hands on you, the W Universe ain't gonna be there to save you. And we'll see who's laughing then. I've been fighting for a long time, but it's time for me to finally make my mark on the WWE. And I'm going to do it using you as my instrument. I want to beat you so badly that the other superstars will fear getting in my way. They won't even want to look me in the eye. Wow, Samoa Joe not messing around here tonight. He is a man on a mission. John Carter, what's he going to reply back? You're not ready for this. Where you're at, where I'm at, if you face me now, you're going to get destroyed. You're going to lose in a way that you can never recover from. I don't want to have to do that to you. Well, a bit of compassion, a bit of remorse there. A bit of empathy for John, from John Carter. I mean, it's not the Carter that we normally see. Normally he's really willing to beat the hell out of anyone at any given time. And Joe now! Oh, what a low blow by Samoa Joe! Wow! Joe not messing around. Well, he said, any time, any place, he's ready to destroy Joe. Well, how about now? Joe and Cutter now in the ring. Here we go. Cutter with a big knee strike to Samoa Joe on the head. Big shots now by Cutter. Striking away on Samoa Joe. Well, Joe with a huge low blow. Cutter looks to be in some rough shape right now. It was a bit of a stiff shot, if I can say that. Well... We'll see if Carter can get the better of Joe now. He tried it earlier on. It didn't work out. Can he do it now? Close on now by Joe. Joe now with a head scissors. Carter's desperately trying to get out. Locked those legs around the head of John Carter. And now Joe with a clubbing clothesline. And the referee's trying to get himself involved. Getting Joe out of there. Referee gets shrugged away. But these two are done. Well, Joe talking to Renee Young about what just happened. And now, oh, Carter from behind. It's not over yet. The referee may have stopped it earlier on, but they are not done yet at all. Not by a long shot. Here we go again. Carter and Joe still coming after one another. This time backstage. Carter with some big strikes to Joe. Now the knee into the kidneys of Joe as well. Looking to really wear down and punish Samoa Joe here tonight. John Carter looking good. Some big strikes to Joe. Some big right hands. Even a, a couple of kicks as well. Well, Samoa Joe's face is as red as a tomato because it is receiving some clubbing blows from Cutter. This time, though, able to take Cutter off the off his feet with an STO. And now has a steel chair in hand. Look out. Oh, he connects there on Cutter. And even throws the chair at him as well. John Carter's in a bad, bad way. Bouncing off the wall now as well. Wow, Carter is in major, major trouble right now. Samoa Joe can really put the pack to punch now to John Carter and perhaps finish him off for good here tonight. These two, all episode, have been after one another. John Carter's trying to hang in there, but at the moment, Joe really punishing him. Joe pretty happy with himself right now as well as Carter's off his feet. No signs of life, really, for Cutter. Joe looking to finish him off now. Tries him again. Face first off the wall. Bouncing off in trouble majorly right now. But Cutter back to his feet. Look out now. Here we go! With a T-bone suplex by Cutter. Huge move there by Cutter. And now lines him up. Hits the DDT. Cutter gets the better of the situation here. He gets the better of the two tonight, ladies and gentlemen. That is it for our episode of Karimo. We are now rivals with Samoa Joe, which means I think we can challenge for his championship. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please smash the like button for us. And also, subscribe to see more Karimo videos coming away very soon.